caught on tape, if only. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 spectacular historic events we wish we had on film. For this list, we're ranking the most important historical and prehistorical events that either occurred prior to the invention of moving film or were otherwise not captured by the medium. Where are you going? Well, I want to see it from the hilltop. For the record, we're not arguing for or against some of the more controversial events on this list, but simply recognizing their relevance and how each of them shaped the course of history. Let it burn! Let it burn! Number 10, the extinction of the dinosaurs. Run, run, run. There are many theories as to what killed off arguably the most impressive species of creature to ever walk the earth. Was it a giant meteor strike, climate change, a lack of sustainable food source? The answer remains one of life's great mysteries. What killed the dinosaurs? The Ice Age! <laughs> Despite tons of reputable scientific research lending credence to some of these aforementioned theories, while it would be great to have recorded documentation of the dinosaur's extinction, imagine how brave and or stupid one would have to be to film these beasts live and in the flesh. Braver than us, that's for sure. Number 9. The Creation of the Vredefort Crater The history behind this gigantic crater can be traced back over two billion years, when one of the largest asteroids to ever strike the Earth's surface made impact upon what is now South Africa. The Vredefort crater possesses a diameter of almost 200 miles and can be seen from space. Three towns are contained within its massive central dome, with Perez offering visitors tours of the general area. Even so, much of the original impact made by the meteor has eroded over time, so it would be astounding to see the caldera in all its former glory. Just imagine how fearsome the original disaster might have been to anyone unfortunate enough to be caught in its path. Number 8. The Eruption at Toba and the Aftermath Mount Toba, the biggest volcanic eruption for the last 25 million years, blocked out the sun. Some 60 to 70,000 years ago, this massive volcanic eruption occurred in the area of Lake Toba, in what is now the Sumatra region of modern-day Indonesia. For a long time, some scientists theorized that the impact of this super explosion had a worldwide effect. It was hypothesized that it brought about what is known as a volcanic winter, a drastic reduction in global temperature due to the excess of volcanic ash obscuring the sun. More recent findings discounted a lot of these claims, but did prove that the volcanic debris traveled twice as far as previously thought. If this dust gets into water and you have to drink it, it can actually turn the water into poison. Toba's eruption was likely an impressive sight, and had it been caught on film, we would have had an even better idea of its effects. Oh my God. Number 7. The Construction of the Pyramids of Egypt Humanity has constructed a great many marvelous buildings and structures over the course of history, yet the Great Pyramids of Egypt remain among the most impressive. The Great Pyramid of Giza is one of the ancient seven wonders of the world, and the only one to stand relatively intact, despite its age of over 4,000 years. What's particularly fascinating about the pyramids, however, is their iconic shape the construction of which likely took between 10 and 20 years to complete. This complicated construction process makes the Egyptian pyramids some of the most mysterious structures in the world, and an undertaking we would have loved to have seen documented on film. Slaves are exodusing as we speak. Well, I say good riddance to bad rubbish. Okay, but who's gonna build your pyramids? Well, we could... <gasps> After them! Number six, the Battle of Waterloo. Never interrupt your enemy when he's making a mistake. That's bad manners, eh? Napoleon Bonaparte was one of history's most celebrated and successful military minds, having conquered many opposing armies during his tenure as emperor in the years following the French Revolution. 
The Battle of Waterloo, however, proved that not even Napoleon was invincible on the battlefield. Votre Excellence! Donnez l'ordre à l'artillerie de commencer le bombardement. Mon général, mais dites-le leur! This complex and fascinating military campaign resulted in Bonaparte's defeat against a combined Prussian and English offensive. The opposing armies, led by Prussia's General Field Marshal Blücher and the British future Duke of Wellington, routed Napoleon on that fateful 18th day of June 1815. Yet Waterloo was, by all accounts, a clash between great military minds of the era, a battle that modern-day historians surely wish had been preserved for posterity. They will chain you like Prometheus to a rock, where the memory of your own greatness will gnaw you. Number five, the Carrington event. These storms are basically electrical storms, and they can affect spacecraft, ground power systems, the GPS can be upset. This 1859 historic event certainly wasn't captured on film. However, the potential of it happening again in humanity's lifetime makes it feasible, yet hopefully unlikely, that we could get another shot. This massive solar storm is referred to as the Carrington Event after one of the astronomers who observed the sunspots and flashes in the sky. The event resulted in heavy electromagnetic damage to electronic equipment around the world. A similar solar storm disaster today would be even more severe, as so many aspects of our current society rely upon electricity. A storm of similar size and magnitude actually came dangerously close to Earth in 2012, though thankfully missed impact by a scant nine days. We started looking at the first pictures, and it was almost in focus. And as soon as we focused it, it was just beautiful. Number four, the Battle of Thermopylae. This epic battle between the Persian Empire and a combined force of Greek city-state soldiers was famously dramatized in director Zack Snyder's 2006 film, 300. This is Sparta! The film was itself based upon a graphic novel from Frank Miller and Lynn Varley, which covered the Battle of Thermopylae, one of history's most famously doomed final stands against decisive odds. Bold Leonidas gives testament to our bloodline. His roar is long and loud. The battle itself placed a comparatively small rear guard of 300 Spartans and just over a thousand fellow Greeks against a Persian army numbering over 100,000. Sparta's King Leonidas and his men boldly held off Persia's invading Xerxes I for as long as they could, before betrayal and insurmountable numbers doomed the defense to death. That's the best you can do! If the real thing was anything like 300, it would have been an event made for film. Number three, the life and death of Jesus Christ. Father, forgive them, for they know not what they do. There have been numerous dramatic depictions of the life and death of Jesus Christ on the silver screen, from the reverential to the controversial. If you die this way, you die like a man. You turn against God, your father. There's no sacrifice. There's no salvation. Yet for many Christians, the chance to have recorded film of Jesus' actual existence is something whose worth would be indescribable. Biblical scholars agree that Jesus existed historically, but there is disagreement about which aspects of his recorded life are factual. A film record might help to settle some of these questions, both for Christians and for those from other religions who are impacted by his influence. The life and death of Jesus Christ is something that intellectuals from both religious and secular sectors find compelling to this day. All I'm saying is that change will happen with love, not with killing. Either way, it's dangerous. It's against Rome. It's against the way the world is. Number two, the eruption of Vesuvius and destruction of Pompeii. The eruption of Italy's Mount Vesuvius in 79 AD is one of the few historic events on our list with a written account, detailed in the letters of the man known as Pliny the Younger. The Roman-born lawyer and magistrate wrote two epistles on the volcano's eruption, explaining in great detail the ash, smoke, and lava which destroyed Pompeii, Herculaneum, and many surrounding cities. 
These letters give incredible details as to just how disastrous and apocalyptic the Vesuvius eruption was to anyone unlucky enough to have been caught in its path. But we still wish we could have caught a glimpse. Perhaps we should go back to barracks or the temple. Not before you buy me that drink. Look, it's just smoke. Before we unveil our top pick, here are some honorable mentions. same time as the pyramids in Egypt are under construction. Workers here complete the outer circle of Stonehenge. Number one, the Big Bang. probably thinking, how could anyone have been there to film the origins of the universe? And we know, you're right. But how mind-blowing would it be to have recorded evidence of the moment when the universe expanded, cosmic density gave way, and then, bam, existence. As impossible as filming it may have been, such a film record could give us answers about where we come from, how we got here, and where we're going. You know, we're sitting on four million pounds of fuel, one nuclear weapon, and a thing that has 270,000 moving parts built by the lowest bidder. Oh, makes you feel good, doesn't it? These things unite us and keep us moving forward, with the Big Bang representing that moment of fantastic universal possibility. Too bad God didn't have a camcorder. Now that's a prayer. Yeah. Do you agree with our list? Are you not entertained? Which spectacular historic event do you wish you could revisit on film? For more insightful top tens published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. This sucks. Things were so much better back in the garden. I'm sure God will let us return soon. I mean, how long can he hold a grudge?